My name is Carl Deutsch. I'm a graphic designer, and this segment is on how to finish a good poster design. Um, so now that I have my poster basically finished, um, the way the, the press prefers to have it is in a press-ready PDF. So before you send these files to press, you want to make a press-ready PDF that they can use. The best way to do that is under your file menu and export. But actually, before making this PDF, let's, let's clean up the page here a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and get out of the preview mode. And you'll see that I have some things on my pasteboard over here that I don't necessarily need for the final version. So I'm going to select this and delete it. Select this as well and delete that. And then I'll make a PDF. Just save this to my desktop. Call it sunriverposter.pdf. I'm going to try to keep any spaces or odd characters. This underscore is not considered an odd character. You want to kind of keep spaces, ampersands, um, even sometimes hyphens out of your file name because they can sometimes get messed up when they go through the rip stations at the printer. So I'm going to save this PDF. Use either the high quality print or this next one down, the X1A 2001. And be sure this is where you would include your bleed. If you want to include a bleed, you can check that and it uses the settings or if you want to customize it and only give it a bleed on the right side, you can. Generally speaking, you would do it on all four sides. All of your crop marks, registration marks, all of that is here as well. So all of your PDF settings are basically in here. So I'm going to go ahead and click Export. And we'll just ignore it. You need to update your links. And then it makes a PDF, which I placed here on my desktop. So there's your PDF. And it's ready for press. Some presses also request that you package the document. And this includes all the fonts and the images. So what I'm going to do is click on package. Now here it says there are some problems. It looks like some of these images use the RGB color space. So you want to go ahead and click on package, save it. Place the package on your desktop or wherever you, you choose. And that puts everything here on my desktop. You have the InDesign document, you have your links, and you have your fonts. So it should have everything you need to send that to press. If you include this PDF, then the press should have no reason to call you back and ask you any questions. My name is Carl Deutsch, I'm a graphic designer, and that segment was on good poster design and how to finish them.